What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Steve Boosa GS. We got another scorecard reaction for y'all, and you already know what it is. Let's go. Get it. All right, we're going to do this one a little bit different. We switched it up a little bit, right? First off, uh, shout out to Jovi. Shout out to everybody that's been supporting from Cameroon. Um, I asked that he put this whole album on YouTube so that we can get some reactions off to it. Uh, he said, no problem. Uploaded it. Salute my guy. Like, what more from GS Gang could we ask for? You know what I'm saying? But to have the opportunity to have all of our audience feast on some dope shit, I'm excited about that. We are going to switch it up, though. So because I was supposed to do it earlier in the week, I'm not going to lie. I was a little bit sad. My mood wasn't right. I didn't want to do any of the reactions when I wasn't in a good mood because I didn't want my mood to hamper how I felt about the song. Does that make sense? So we did wait a little bit longer. I told you we'd have it like last week, but shit happens. We're here now, right? Uh, with that being said, what we're going to do differently is I'm giving you guys two songs instead of one. Uh, so we're going to do the intro and the outro off of the new album that he dropped. And the reason that we're doing that, we're not going to do like a full scorecard. We're going to score it 1 to 10 like an album review, but we're going to score it based on how you rank it as an intro or as an outro. If you guys are familiar with the channel, whenever we break down, we do like album reviews, things of that nature. Placement on the album usually determines how much stuff I let slide um, in my own personal bias when it comes to like having uh, people talk through tracks or you know certain samples that get used, how long you let the, the beat breathe for. Like there's a lot of shit that goes into does this fit and make a dope intro, does this fit and make a good outro, or should this have been placed someplace in the middle? And we haven't had that conversation yet. I figured we have a brand new mixtape or album in front of us, might as well hop into it and have that discussion. Alright, I'm done. Do me a favor, run the gauntlet, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, little bell notification guy. I was a little long-winded of an intro, but we here, we here, we here. Um, as always, if there is stuff that's going to be in multiple languages, I think he speaks a ridiculous amount of languages on on average. Uh, down in the comments below, anything that we don't pick up and you guys want to translate for me, I always appreciate you guys so much. Uh, so we go, intro and outro off, Young Vaizu, Anointed Maboko Supreme. If I'm mispronouncing any of that, I apologize. Let's get it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have to write, you can read it. Started with a doubt, not a haters. Believe it, I believe when I drop, niggas chop my shit. Line them up in the road, niggas know I doesn't gotta love it. Finger on the trigger, I'ma pull it. Dumping all these wrongs, all they hate, I'ma kill it. Cha -cha. Alright, a couple things going into this, right? As far as the intro goes, I like the, the, the artistic decision here. Listen to the beat build up, right? We, we, we're expecting a huge beat drop and a huge payoff, hopefully on a dope bar. I like this as an intro. I like that build up the energy. This is telling me that we're in for probably a high energy type type album. You know what I'm saying? Based on the shit that he's talking in the first 30 seconds, how we feel this building up to a drop, I would be very surprised if this was like... An emotional R&B, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can tell what the intent is there. Let's bring it back and see if you can pick up on that too. I like that. To write, you can read it. Started with a doubt, not a haters. Believe it, I believe when I drop, niggas chop my shit. Line them up in the road, niggas know I doesn't gotta love it. F we gotta work on the syllable rhymes a little bit in English. Trigger, I'ma pull it. Dumping all these rhymes, all they hate, I'ma kill it. Cha cha, boy, I don't dax, but my lyrics go bang on the beat. Niggas tell you who the real is. I don't care why you say you can't rap like this. I don't got all your bars, you know they not like this. So that wasn't even like a full drop yet. It still feels like it's building up. We got a little bit of a drop, right? But it wasn't the big payoff we were waiting for yet. Whole life trying to find a man. I ain't realer than mobile crew split the thing into dividends. I emphasize you can really fuck with me though. You pillow talking while we out here talking kilos. The brick look like Sweezy took it to Primo. I'm too dope. T'Challa, a superhero. Yeah, I ain't scared of no shit. I. Payoff was a little bit disheartening. We got the official beat drop at a minute in. Um, I think the bars that he's coming off of was dope. I like that the 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 T'Challa line was dope to come into it. But then the beat just kind of like 
sashayed into it instead of having like a dramatic payoff. That kind of that disappointed me a little bit right there. Like the bar, like he was doing the thing. You could tell he was building it up. I feel like the beat was a little bit of a letdown right there. This little this little cha cha that the beat came into instead of having an explosion. Like I feel like they would have paid off for having something bigger there. Into dividends. I emphasize you can really fuck with me though. You pillow talking while we are here talking kilos. The brick look like Sweezy took it to Primo. I'm too ah. T Chala, a superhero. Ah. Yeah. See, like that was fire. You should and then come into it. Instead, we got the little maracas. Come on, man. All right, I'm gonna stop harping. Let's go. T Chala, a superhero. Yeah, I scared on no shit. Niggas be on my dick. Be on my dick, yeah. I'ma let that bitch hit Back shots if she thick Pull down her blouse and then come on her tits yeah. I'ma send him away, I'ma piss on his grave Man do me so way, I just stop misbehave yeah. I go whip out for day, you go let sense today Me I don't hesitate, wave out on a spray yeah. My nine speak for itself, my rhyme leap of the shelf A lion king in the flesh, I kind of feed of the flesh I'm beat feeding myself, the beast needed my help That's why I speak to myself, I'm trying to see what the heck I Yo, he said, he said the beats needed my help. It is. He's carrying this. Jovi is carrying this. His cadence, the aggression with which he's like building this up and going. Like, this needs to be on a dober beat. He is legitimately carrying the beat. Normally, you have in situations where a beat will carry a whack rapper. Here we have an instance where you have a rapper who's like building up the energy and shit like that and is carrying a, a subpar beat. A lion king in the flesh, I kind of feed of the flesh I'm beat feeding myself, the beast needed my help That's why I speak to myself, I'm trying to see what the heck I don't try to perfect it, the way I am respected Always got selected, when you got rejected CD deck ejected, playlist deleted First I was neglected, now I'm being a prophet Master after all the talk is my world, the highway Men and go just shit on for some corner, join the highway Now say we be fair day, they never jump for five days Man don't run with rap, no be the pill, boy I don't take Baby get a nice shape, tic ties, fine Ways. Look at his room lost like because I shy babe I'm on the crime wave surfing must have died day Flexing on the beat cause to me that shit is lightweight What's up with the confusion on my knuckle brother out Just to end the conversation no room for a discussion Leave you in a concussion hand the hammers with a grip Like I'm into construction if the men ain't know the beef okay. There is no go fit function There's no need to mention I don't need no introduction Man this me from boy and I go need protection I don't do the race but I still win the election I already came but I still got an erection and every night I flirt with perfection You walking with a guard, you can save your suggestions You here to learn a lesson, I'm here to ask questions huh? Alright, so it's, I, I hope we don't have 40 seconds of let Like the beat isn't good enough to let this beat run out for the next 40 seconds As far as an intro track goes I'm very curious to see how you guys score. Let me know in the comments below. How do you score this one to ten as an intro track? I'm going to give my two cents on it. Let's let it run out. Let's see if we have uh, any talking or anything like that for the next 40 seconds, and then um, go into it. Down in the comments below, what'd you guys rate this 1 to 10? Here's how I'm looking at this, right? Jovi did his thing. I'm not going to lie. He came in and did his thing. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10, and it's because of the beat. I don't think the beat was strong enough to give it 40 seconds. That's almost a third of the song at the end. All of the good shit about this, all the things I liked about this, the intensity, the street shit, talking my shit, like he had a little bit of toxicity in there, all the stuff that we love to listen to. He did it. It just, it didn't feel like he was getting the support that he needed on this track. Like, if somebody else took these vocals and re-engineered this beat that to just be something that, that just dumps a little bit harder, I think, I think you got a clear cut. Like, he, he understood the assignment. You could tell, like, he had the build up and everything like that was going. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10 with opportunity to improve. 7 out of 10 with opportunity to improve. Um, let's go. Outro now. So now we done had, I think it's like 16 tracks. Uh, it looks like some of these might not actually be from the thing though, right? So we got like 16 tracks. Maybe 15. 15 total. 
Let's see how he decides to end it. Let's get this outro popping. Let's see. Right off the bat, before we even get into it, it feels, I like that, the solemnness, listen to it, right? This feels like the conclusion of an album, right? So right off the bat, you could, you could, you could pick that up, the kind of like, the, the, the solemnness of the beat and shit like that. It feels like, it, it feels appropriate. does it, Bijou does it, believe that. My peeps read the code, no sleep till I retire When you own your own business, you can never be fired Was born ha. late, swag on trip, check my attire My love to single moms, you the one that I admire I Niggas think it high Let's go! Is that ending with positive messages and shit like that? Um, I like the tonality, the tonality matches the beat, the beat matches it being an outro perfect, I honestly think at 30 seconds into it, we're gonna end up liking this more as an outro than we did the intro, um, it's just because it feels like a lot of the pieces of the puzzle are in, just, just instantly correct, they're where they're supposed to be right off the bat. Hey, but I'm higher, flow got a manufactured date but it don't expire, already complex, how the mind is wired, mind wired different, barbed wire bracelets, tell me that you tasteless, backstabbers always come faceless, can't face the truth cause the cowards they move backwards, you with me now, forget anything prior, I bring to the table more than what's required, you can never quench my fire, me I know the tire, if she says she don't love me she a liar, we stay together like a choir, before the bloggers started getting hired Before the hoverboards came with two tires You sell tickets if my name is on the flyer Command number one's rap supplier I put that on the gang And this is what we're talking about Like having these kind of clips and shit Like first of all that verse was hard as shit I like that This is super dope I'm 100% on board with this Now Putting these, these these clips right here, so listen, I got either, it's either going to be a sample or a skit or something like that that's getting put in the middle. As an outro, I'm not mad at it, right? If this was in the middle, obviously I would have had something to say about it. This was like track five or some shit like that. Like, why are you doing that in the middle? I like this. I like this for the outro. I'm the one you cannot handle Bulletproof vest with the Uzi like I'm Rambo Stop by snap burger just to pick up Rando I got that for my skin, come on jab with leather sandals Still cooking cause the heat I can handle On the beat I'm a vandal But in real life it's a full time job, avoid the scandals Just like Jada, my ex got entangled I overlook my view, it depends on the angle But land when I was still paying rando Skipping taxis to find PCs to render My footage from the shoot, I can't pretend though Chuck. Another wrong move, now they won't frame you Go crazy when they find out they can't tame you Thinking that you changed me ah. while you still the same you That's what the game do Chuck. From the day I step to the door, I run the building Whenever I step on the beat, I make a killing Niggas think they're better than me, it's just a feeling Now only up bro, no ceilings up, up, up. Now only up bro, no ceiling Vocal till I die, two, three, seven, bitch Get so now we're gonna be looking at like 24 seconds the drift off on the the outro here like that feels a lot better 20 seconds letting the beat run out while i talk my shit as the outro feels a lot lot more reasonable than 40 seconds of nothing but beat on the intro uh to, to start it off to start off an album okay. Much more reasonable. It's like a nine. It's like a cool nine. Honestly, if some of his if some of his actual rhyme patterns were tightened up a little bit and he 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 tweaked it, he had a little bit more like interlocking rhymes and everything didn't feel so that that's that that's this would have been a ten out of ten uh, outro. I liked it. I liked it. Nine out of ten. Uh, as far as the outro goes, I think this cleaned up tonality, this cleaned up having a beat, this cleaned up having the, the 40 seconds on the outro, the 24 seconds, a really good placement of like a really quick sample in the middle instead of a hook. I don't like the idea of going out on a song with a hook for your outro. He did it. He did the jump. I like this a lot. 9 out of 10 is my score. What do you score? Let me know down in the comments below. We got a 7 on the intro, a 9 on the outro. Uh, as always, again, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. I will catch y'all on the next one. I appreciate your support more than you guys know. A lot.